Hello friends, for today's fraction practice, you're going to play an awesome game called Saddest Fraction from gregtangmath.com. We've played a few of his other games and this is a great one to continue to practice partitioning um, objects into equal parts and studying our fractions, working on the numerator and the denominator. So the game that you're going to choose, there's four different choices for your game modes. The one that you're going to choose is identify. So first you're going to click identify. Then it's going to ask you easy or hard. We're going to work on the easy version to start. Now the directions say find three cards that have the same meaning. You'll notice the cards that are pink are the words to describe the fractions like one sixth, one eighth, or one fourth. The green cards have the written fractions with the numerator and the denominator. And the blue cards are the picture representations of those fractions. So what I like to do is I start with a color. I start with blue and I look and I see one blue out of eight. So that's one eighth. Then I look for the green to see if there's a fraction written. I don't see one eighth, so I know it can't be the one that has the three cards that match. What about one out of four? One fourth. Here's the fraction one fourth. And last, can I find pink? One fourth. There it is. Next, it'll give you a second um, set of cards. Hand two out of three. It shows you right here. So again, I start with the picture. One out of two, one half. Then I look for the fraction, one half, and do I have the words? One, oh, one eighth, one third, one fourth. That can't be it. Let's try another one. One out of three, one third, one third, one third. Let's see, one third picture, one third fraction, one third words. Nice. It'll deal my third hand. Here we go. One out of eight, one eighth, fraction, one over eight, one eighth, and words, one eighth, one eighth. Here we go, one, two, three. Nice, play that game at least three rounds to practice your fractions. Have fun with it, do your very best.